is a pint of poo today. No, who says that? Well, I've read Nonsense. reviews. I've read, they never said about Fridays. I do have no. to say that. Point, point that out. <laughs> but however, today we're talking about poo. And why are we doing that, darling? Well, because Mike? various celebrities have been putting it on their faces, apparently. Really? They're, they're, they're covered in... Including Harry Styles. Did you read about that? So they put, I think it's bird poo face pack things. Um, there you are, Harry and Donald oh. Richard. Mm. Um, so we thought we'd check this out. Is it a bizarre stupidness or does it work? Mm. So we've got Alison Hammond. Yes. Yes, yes. Thanks. she often Good. talks. Cheers. Yes. Thanks for that. <laughs> you have you know, I've interviewed the famous people yeah. and now I'm talking about this. Yes. Are you a practitioner or, or an advocate? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> what are you trying to say? No, I'm not at all. But I just thought, I thought it was interesting. It's very educational. Interesting. Well, we were just assuming, weren't we, that it was things that people put on their faces. But there's it's all just, sorts. Listen, I've got an array of things to an show array. you. We're going to start off with the coffee. This is called the Kopi Nuwak coffee. And it's derived from the civic cat. It's derived from the Asian palm civic cat, okay? It's their cat. There they It's quite a cute Aww, cat, actually. Yeah. And they, uh, at Screet, um... They, <laughs> that was so yeah, it's the right word. They, they well do. Done, they they, they well. excrete. Um, what do they eat? Hold on. They eat the berries. They eat the berries. They eat the berries, right? But they only go for the best berries, so you get the best bean going. <laughs> so they eat the bean. <laughs> it goes through. <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this, but basically, <laughs> this is a coffee. It's worth thirty-two pounds ninety-nine. So it's very, very expensive. These little critters. <laughs> 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 I'm just trying to explain this. Yes. So they eat the best berries, the best ones. They yeah. go in the inside of them. They yeah. squeak these, so we yeah. can be guaranteed that this coffee only has the best. Yes, the farmers. Yes, right. apparently it, it creates mm -hmm. shorter peptides in yes. the beans. It gets rid of the okay. amino acids, yes, as well. improving the flavour in yeah. them. Do you the want to process. Try it? I don't want to taste it. No, I do. No, I don't. Right, you taste, taste it. it. But it let me say, let me say, as you're tasting yeah. it, the process which takes place on the islands of Sumatra, Java, yeah. and Sulawesi in the Indonesian archipelago. Smells nice. Excuse me, darling. Let me finish. Creates a strong, intense, pungent taste. Okay. Which I have absolutely. It smells beautiful. Smell that. Smells lovely. I don't drink. It's funny I don't drink coffee anyway. But anyway, there we go today. <laughs> so that's from Coffee Direct. Yeah. Coffee lovely. Direct is thirty-two ninety-nine. Oh, okay. Apparently, very, very so, strong, but very also, good. Also, a lot of uh, these big Hollywood stars. The talk is that they smear creams that that have been. Excreted. Excretion cream. Through a through an animal. This has been excreted through a goat. Okay, now obviously the argan oil. I've comes heard from of goat's the cheese before. <laughs> no, but listen, argan oil, we all know well, well, it all comes from the argan tree. And it's very, very expensive. It's very expensive yeah. and very rich. Okay, now this it looks lovely. They there. get this cream from a goat. So they I literally send the goat up the tree to eat the seeds. And I'm not lying, no. there are goats in the tree. Look. <laughs> It looks as if it's that photoshopped. Is, yeah, is that for real? Seriously, they, they climb up the little tree because apparently the trunk is quite small. They, eat, they eat the, the fruit uh -huh. and then they secrete it and then the farmers gather it up and they make this cream out of it. This and they this crush is it all down. They crush it all down and they make this tree. And th this is one of the rarest oils <laughs> in the world and we can it see is. why. We can see you can't why. get many goats to get up a tree. How good is that? <laughs> So that cream is fourteen ninety nine. So it's quite and expensive. Try a bit. It smells beautiful. Okay. Happy smell. Mm -hmm. yeah, it smells lovely. It's a lovely cream. But they do all argan oil in shampoo. Darling, stuff like that, don't they? that's been out an animal's bottom. Why are you doing that it's for? Not that it's not it's there's so much rubbish in creams today. This is organic. Have you seen that? That's real, that's stuff, real that rubbish. That smell there. is gorgeous. <laughs> no. okay. It's all natural. This yeah. is uh, paper and books made from elephant and rhino excrement. Of course it is. Okay, and what they do is they put the poo in a big dryer. And in case you, in case you doubt that, as you can see here, it's got little bit, not, there's bits still in it. <laughs> Right. But it doesn't smell. It doesn't smell at all. Oh, well, but still, when you're writing on that, you still know what that is. Exactly. So they, they put it all together with the, the paper recycled, and they make sure it's all evenly dispersed, and they make a bit of paper. Mm -hmm. It's a whole new meaning to poison pen letters. <laughs> that, so there you go. That's from a company appropriately called yeah. the Exotic Paper Company. <laughs> do they make loo roll out of that? That would be oh, really completing yeah, well, this that cycle. That would be a good idea. Going full circle, wouldn't well, it? Yeah, yeah. Do they have animals that are vegans to do that? Mm -hmm. No. All of that's relatively recent poo, it has to be said. Yeah. This is ancient poo. This is, this is very the art of millions ancient and millions poo, right? of dollars. Let me move over. 
Okay, this is called dinosaur corporalize. Now, when I take the word corporalize, it just makes me sound really intelligent for saying dinosaur poo. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it starts off in this raw state down here after millions and millions of years. It doesn't look that great, does it? But after mineralization, doesn't that sound clever? Yeah. After mineralization, it turns with this to this beautiful effect and it's got like a marble effect on it and it doesn't smell anymore and it doesn't smell it's odorless and it's rock solid and we've got these beautiful necklaces that come in at around two pounds <laughs> fifty uh, and you can get that from dinofossil.co.uk or you could go for these beautiful cufflinks which cost 65 pounds from gilbert and skeggs there you go would you wear those skeggs <laughs> So basically, yeah. this is polished poo. Yeah, this basically. This is fucked up poo. Yeah, but it's millions and it's millions, millions of years old. old. I don't, I, I still poo. It's amazing. Yeah, it oh. is. But it doesn't smell like poo. It's just, it's rock solid. Okay. <laughs> Move on. <laughs> Move on. Different. It's yeah. a different gift. Yeah, it's a different gift. For the man who's got everything. Oh, <laughs> so it's got some poo coupling. <laughs> okay, so what this, is this? This is a perfume now. Okay, so this is called Am Amber Grey. And this is made from sperm whale poo. Oh, it gets worse all the time. Okay, now it comes, it nor, when it when he actually first poos, it settles on the water. And then over a few years, it looks like that. Can you see it? Those two, they are very touched up. You don't have to touch like kidney stones. Yeah, like that. There you go. And then someone obviously has to find it. And they go through a little bit of process of filterization. Then after four months, it looks like that. You can have a smell if you want. But ambergris, nice. again, I think it's mm. used in lots of yeah, it is. and scents, isn't That's it? That's very true. But they use a synthetic version, which is this. But this is, is the pure the stuff? stuff. What you're holding there is the pure ambergris. Stick? Yeah, it's not very nice at that stage. Do you ever hear the phrase, when <laughs> someone stands and poo, they still smell of roses? <laughs> Well, this is <laughs> this is basically this is, it. This, this is, is the synthetic version that all the shops use, and it's a white version. That that you'll find that in most perfumes, to be honest with you. But this, after six months, it looks like that, and then they use it. That's the men's perfume, and that's the ladies' perfume. It's called um, 1953 Pour Homme. It's 79 pounds, and this is 1953 Eau de Toilette, the lady? which is 53 pounds, and it smells oh, absolutely lovely. Stupid. So honestly, it's not it be on, your, not be on you all day. It's fine. Just look at that. Well, that is silly. Beautiful. Smell of poo. It's gone through a process. Through a process. It's gone 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 through a process. It's, it's, it's a whole new well, world. Uh, you've opened up, so to Have speak. I? Yes. yes. A whole, <laughs> whole new, world. new experience to there us here go. today. If it's good enough for Harry Styles. I think it's lovely. See, that argan oil smells gorgeous. Oh. It does. Smell. It doesn't. It smells like only only large. You know what it's no. made of. Right. Well, lovely. <laughs> it's nice. If you would like to find out more.